Okay, so today is the day before my last of three ceremonies and after my second ceremony. It's like six, five days, five days since my last ceremony. Um, I had a very unique experience with my second ceremony. I did not purge there at Nova's beautiful space. Um, I did when I got home, but it, I, there's a there's an interesting thing that I will just say is like a disclaimer. Um, if you live far from her property, uh, definitely rest a little, prepare with lots of sun protection, meaning like a hat or uh, sunglasses, because I feel like the travel for me um, has gotten a little extra out <laughs> on the way home. That being said, um, I had a very unique and beautiful experience where I kind of just went into a deep meditation and felt like the medicine was working on me in a different way. And this is this is the thing that I feel like I'm really taking away from this medicine is it is psychedelic. It is not uh, hallucinogenic, but psychedelic in the sense that my perception is shifting in like leaps and bounds. Nova said quantum leap, and I think that's really appropriate because that's what it feels like. It feels like depending on whatever degree I'm willing to let it happen in my perception and my grid of reality, literally how deep I'm willing to let it go um, or surrender to the, that depth and, and me, I don't know, that's getting pretty fucking deep over here. But uh, the more that I was able to surrender in the moment of my last ceremony, it seems like there's this overall thing happening in my experience. And the medicine definitely seems to work after ceremony, kind of like momentum or like drip drying. I don't know. I really appreciate this though. And there's, there's this shrinking part of me that, I mean, really that's the thing I put into, put into um, proprioception for myself and putting outside of myself to look at is like this piece of me that I think is me that is afraid or um, resisting the process of release. All It's just amazing to see for myself how much is chunked off in terms of fear, in terms like I really find myself more in this and this is just the framework that I'm plugging all this experience into for myself is just like the witness. I'm just witnessing my life and witnessing the peaks and valleys of feelings that for myself and from others. And this medicine is not for everyone, disclaim for show, but, and it is for the, for those that are really ready for that quantum leap. This is definitely a very, very useful, wonderful, amazing medicine. And Nova is the best space pilot of all time. Love, love her. I love you, Nova. <laughs> um, truly, though. I first thing I saw when I showed up, before even doing the medicine, um, I saw her aura just beaming and bright <clears throat> circles white circles coming out of her strong protection absolutely pure energy uh her and pepita her dog reiki one certified dog <laughs> it's all it's all very perfectly sacred it feels like you're kind of in the in the jungle forest outside of it's like the retreat that you want to go to another country for is just right outside of portland in a really beautiful sacred space held by somebody who just means it so yeah I'm I'm, I'm ex excited but I'm also just like I love watching this movie of life unfold and I'm really grateful that this has been something to kind of accelerate that process like I'm still eating like the best most whole organic food simple 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 I feel like I'm reconnecting with myself in a way that I just don't even know 
I just have to let go in order to find out. And this is an incredible tool in helping me do exactly that. So, okay, ready for the bullet point. <laughs>